How do butterflies eat? Butterflies take in nourishment through their proboscis. A proboscis is a thin, tube-like organ that allows a butterfly to draw liquid from a flower or plant. Think of yourself drinking juice or water through a flexible straw. This is essentially what a butterfly does when it drinks using its proboscis. When a butterfly is finished drinking, its proboscis curls back up toward its face so it won't get in the way as the butterfly moves through the air. Isn't that convenient? What do butterflies eat? You probably already know that butterflies eat or are nourished by drinking flower nectar. But that's not the only food source of butterflies. Butterflies land on pieces of rotten fruit to drink the leftover juice. Vegetable plants like zucchini, pumpkins, radishes, artichokes, and asparagus have blossoms that contain nectar. So, it's not unusual to see butterflies making their way through a patch of vegetables to drink vegetable nectar. They also land on herbs with blossoms that yield nectar. Some of those herbs are parsley, oregano, fennel, and dill. Sugar water is another favorite food of butterflies. A butterfly may frequent a feeder put out by someone who is trying to attract hummingbirds to their yard. The sugar water in a hummingbird feeder is appealing to a butterfly if it can get access to it. You may see butterflies hanging around garbage cans at a local park, amusement park, or even a zoo. If you see some, the garbage cans probably contain cups with leftover soda or bottles with a little bit of juice or lemonade in them. These insects are attracted to sugar in practically all forms. So, if there's a drop or two of juice or soda in a cup or bottle, a butterfly will drink it. Bees are also known to hang around trash cans for this same reason. If you see both butterflies and bees at a full trash can, you may notice that they don't bother one another as they go about their work of finding sugary liquid. Butterflies sometimes drink muddy water from puddles after a rainstorm. The next time it rains look around for a mud puddle in a road or on a lawn to see if there are any butterflies gathered around it. They drink the muddy water to get protein, salt, amino acids, and nitrogen. All of these muddy ingredients contribute to the overall health of a butterfly. Sometimes a group of butterflies will gather around a mud puddle only to take off and land again a few seconds later. There is a purpose behind this motion. The butterflies are trying to stir up the minerals in the mud by flapping their wings. This behavior is called puddling. In addition to mud, butterflies drink sweat for its salt. So, if a butterfly lands on someone, it may be interested in a little of the sweat on the person's arm or hand. Of course, it doesn't hurt when a butterfly uses its proboscis to drink sweat from a person's skin. It may tickle a little bit though. Butterflies sometimes drink urine for the minerals contained in it. A butterfly may drink from a pool of urine left behind by an animal. They also drink blood to absorb its nutrients. Butterflies may land on a dead animal that has a wound with blood on it. You'll notice that butterflies are adaptable to landing on anything containing the nutrients they're looking for. How often do butterflies eat? As a general rule, butterflies eat, drink, food every day. Furthermore, they drink their meals several times a day. But, if a butterfly is in an area where it's difficult to find food, it can go a couple of days without it. A butterfly that cannot find food will mate with another butterfly before it dies from starvation. When they do this they are following a powerful instinct to keep the butterfly population going. What time of day do butterflies eat? Midday is when most butterflies look for food and eat. They are especially attracted to flowers and plants growing in direct sunlight. They are cold-blooded animals and need sunlight to stay warm. Have you ever seen a butterfly sitting on a flower or plant with its wings spread out? If so, the butterfly may have been eating. Or, it may have been basking or warming itself in the sunlight. Are butterflies attracted to different plants? Yes. Some plants are more attractive to some types of butterflies than others. Monarch butterflies are especially fond of the nectar from milkweed. Goldenrod, lilacs, and lantana are other plants attractive to monarch butterflies. Eastern swallowtail butterflies are attracted to phlox, buttonbush, and Carolina jessamine. Of course, some plants and flowers appeal to a variety of butterflies. Planting daffodils, wild violets, and sedum can bring a bunch of butterflies to a garden. Don't forget to plant a Budlia david eaka a butterfly bush.